Today, we are going to write the formula for the ionic compound cadmium iodide. So let's work from left to right. I see that I have cadmium. I'm going to scan the periodic table to see where cadmium is. And cadmium is right over here. Cadmium is represented as a C, D. So that's the element cadmium. I'm going to write that down. So I have C, D. But now when we're making a formula, I do need a charge in the upper right hand corner. But cadmium is a transition metal, right? It's in this little box here. But cadmium is special. I would star this element, guys. Cadmium usually only exists as one charge, so you should know the charge. In this case, cadmium is always a plus two charge. It basically is the same as zinc. Zinc is right here in the upper uh, right-hand corner of the transition metals. So cadmium is always going to be a plus two. So that's the charge that we're going to use. Now I have iodide. I see that I have an IDE ending, which means that it's probably going to be a nonmetal somewhere. So I'm looking for the IOD, right, for the iodide, and I see it's right here. Iodine is an I, and it's a halogen. It's in group 7A or 17, and iodine, as long as all the halogens, have a negative one charge. So I'm going to write that down. So I have I with a negative one. Now, since I have both components, all I do is I use these charges and I crisscross them to say how many of each I have. So this two crisscrosses down, telling me that I need two iodines, and this one crisscrosses down, telling me that I need one cadmium. When you do this little trick, don't worry about the charges anymore. You're just worrying about the subscripts. So now you're just basically rewriting what you have. You have CD, cadmium. I only need one of them, so don't worry about that. And then I have iodine, but in this case I have two of them, so I have to write that two there. And there you go. Cadmium iodide is CdI2. I hope this helped. Let me know in the comments. Love talking to you guys. I hope you're doing well, all right? And I hope you're doing well in your classes. Good luck studying. I'm rooting for you guys. You guys got this. I'll see you all in future lessons, all right? Take care. Bye-bye.